up since nearly 5.30 this morning. It's been around two weeks since I came back from Korea, so I don't even know if I can call it jet lag at this point. time in my life I've been a morning shower person was in college my first year I would go to the gym every morning before class I've always been team night shower because I was a firm believer in who wants to go to bed dirty you know I I can't even call it a schedule my daily life has been a bit sporadic since came back showering early in the morning is something that makes me feel not necessarily productive but it definitely makes my day really feel like it's getting started when I'm waking up at these weird hours I'm trying to make it part of my routine to pack more every morning so that way I can ship them out within a day or two of getting placed. While I was in Korea, I felt so inspired to make so many new products to get my shop up and running again. Big thing on this week's to-do list, I want to design some new packing stickers. Grade my packing system in general. It's not that I don't think it's efficient right now, but I'm kind of in the mood to change up the look. Add some new seal stickers to the repertoire. Give the brand a refresh. Today is an exciting day if you've watched my vlog from a little over a month ago. I was talking about my situation or my car situation. We haven't got it washed in a year and a half, probably closer to two years by now. I don't want to put it in neutral. It gives me a lot of anxiety, which seems like a small thing, but today we're going to conquer it. I know there's car washes that can get outside your car and have them do it for you, but really this is more of a thing for me and getting over this irrational fear. Like I'm ready to do it and then no longer will be afraid of it. You can do it girl. This is not that big of a deal. But I wanna deliver these orders first cause I'm also gonna vacuum the inside of my car. It's also been like two years since I've done that. Okay. Okay. I, I took it through myself. Yeah, you do it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 
nice and hard. Bam today. I had from the convenience store in Korea. It looks pretty good if I do say so myself. Mm. It's hard to go wrong with spam. Day three of my Korea trip. We started the day by eating curry, and I know I've been eating a lot of Japanese food. Day three of my Korea trip, we started by eating curry. We started the day by getting some curry. I saw some stray cats in the back of one of the stores, and I think the shop owner was feeding them. You may have noticed, but I've been on the editing grind with the short reels, short form content. I made sure to take a lot of short vlogs with my phone when I was in Korea, so I'm just getting around to editing that now. I don't know, at first I didn't know what I was doing with the short form stuff. It was pretty intimidating because I don't even have TikTok or I didn't have TikTok really for several years when it first started popping off. So I kind of missed that window when everyone was getting into it. I felt like I've always been on the outs. I don't know like the trends or keep up with the sounds or audios or whatever. So it's always been kind of intimidating, but I think I'm finding my own style now. That's crazy how light it is this early. Right now I'm working on making an Instagram group chat for my Korea group trip. May, June, July, August. The trip to Korea is in about four months. And I wanted to make this group chat so we could all start to get to know each other before the trip, coordinate flight times and get our plane tickets. There's going to be an airport shuttle, both to and from the airport. This way we can coordinate similar arrival times so people won't be like waiting at the airport too long because we only have a certain amount of shuttles to work with. We want as many people to be picked up around the same time as possible. Made the group chat for my Japan trip a few weeks ago. Turns out some people aren't able to make it, so we still have a few more slots available for that trip. I'll make sure to link both of the trip tickets in the description box. So this is the time of year that people really start planning out their summer vacations. Hopefully you want to hang out with me as part of your summer. No pressure, but I'd like an invite. Let me stop being cringy for five seconds.
don't know why it's never occurred to me to just pre-stamp all my envelopes. This is the best part. And this way I can actually see when I'm running low on those stamps instead of leaving it all up to these guys and just guessing how many more sheets I have left. Whenever I put the time and effort into making one of my meals look pretty, I get so excited! I can tell this is a mess waiting to happen though. Not to toot my own horn, but this could be in a restaurant. get this fixed tomorrow. Uh, 
My mom sent me a recipe the other day and she made this gochujang pasta. Turns out I actually saved the original video on Instagram before she even sent it to me. It said gochujang pasta and there were a lot of like Korean ingredients incorporated, but it was definitely fusion Korean, I think. I feel like I could have added more spice to it. Good morning. I dropped this while it was on. Oh lord, most likely it's gonna need a whole new lens unit. Okay, how much is that going? Two weeks to get the parts anyway. If I do end up getting it fixed, it would probably be like by the end of the month. <laughs> Poor baby. I Right now, I am working on designing new seal stickers. Thank you. 